thanks to the work of the Diaz brothers, Nace and Nick, the city of Stockton, California, is now famous for the good kind of fighting. And the most recent name to come out of the notorious city could expand that reputation into the world of boxing. In just two and a half years, 19-year-old Gabriel Flores Jr. has boxed his way to a perfect 16-0 record and put the rest of the lightweight division on notice. A stellar amateur career that saw him go 91-7 and take gold at the US Junior National Championships led to Flores becoming the youngest ever signing to top rank at only 16 years of age. To ask Flores, it was no fluke that he has achieved so much so young. Everything we got from now, from the beginning, we hustled for it. You know, we didn't get lucky. People say, oh, you lucky? Ooh, nah, I'm not lucky. I grind. I was in the gym at night, in the morning. You know, when you're sleeping at 4 a.m., I was running outside before high school, before elementary school, so there's no luck about that. Flores' almost inhuman drive is rooted in the kind of tragedy so common to natives of Stockton. When Gabriel was 12, his mother was shot while visiting a children's birthday party the collateral victim of gang violence. Keep her name alive, you know, uh, let her know I don't forget her, let her know I'm here, I'm standing, I'm talking, I'm living, I'm succeeding because of her. And Flores is using his slick movement and chin-stunning jab to fight to change the exact circumstances that led to the loss of his mother, hoping to inspire the city's youth to make more positive choices. I want the kids to know right from wrong and the consequences, he said of becoming a local role model. I want to stop the violence in the city I was born in and the city I love. It's impossible to say how far such a young fighter can go, but with a goal like that, we can all hope Gabriel Flores Jr.'s grind takes him all the way to the top. Thanks for watching, and remember, if you want more fight sports in your life, just hit the subscribe button.